What's going on, utensils? It's I am Spoon, and today I've got a one of spaz gameplay from uh, Black Ops. I had a while back in one of our late night lobbies. Um, if you guys have been seeing me play with uh, Christine and M4O Pixel, and anyway, some other people, those are from our late night lobbies. We get together, to play some COD, have a good time. Um, hmm. But uh, but lately I've been having a hard time, kind of like a a commentator block, if you will, having a hard time trying to decide what to talk about. So I've been tweeting out, be like, "Hey, what do you guys, uh, what do you guys want to hear me talk about?" But, uh, but normally it seems like if I find a topic, I'm not really, you know, an expert in those topics. And so, what I've normally stuck to doing is just rambling about nothing. And so that's what I'm gonna try and do here. Um, I have one guy tell me to talk about tomatoes, and. Um, <laughs> I guess that that's actually a pretty funny idea because um, I was having a discussion recent with, recently with one of my friends saying that the tomato is a vegetable and they're like, no, it's a fruit. I'm like, okay. So I looked it up and for culinary purposes, it's a vegetable, but it could also be considered a fruit. So it's, it's hard to say. It really is. Um, the reason why I say it's probably a vegetable is because I like fruits and I hate tomatoes. I hate them really bad. <laughs> and it doesn't taste like sweet and nice like a like a fruit normally would. But, you know, whatever. So that's one thing. <laughs> it's not really a good topic to talk about, but it's a good thing to hear your response. What do you think tomatoes are? Do you think they're vegetables? Do you think they're fruits? Um, but I, I think mm, it's probably okay to just call it either one. I don't think it really matters. As far as that goes, I think that anything is uh, politically correct. If you wanted to call it a vegetable, nobody's going to be like, that's a fruit. And if you call it a, a fruit, no one's going to be like, that's a vegetable. And if they are, then they <laughs> they should probably just be punched in the face for being a complete douchebag. But uh, but I find a hard time commentating over these uh, these gameplays because it's just it's a video game. And I'm just looking at it and I'm like, hmm, not doing very good. I don't have a FAMAS, I hate using FAMAS while I'm using it. See, that, that's that's like what it is. And a lot of to commentators, they just, when they can't talk about anything, they just talk about the gameplay. So, uh, you see me here running around with a spaz, and uh, I'm going up this uh, this little thing here. Good. And there's a tire there, and uh, yep, yeah, so we still got my spaz. And uh... <laughs> not to hate on anybody that you guys may like watching, but that's just, that's not how I like to... Uh, it's not how I like to do things. I don't really like to watch the gameplay and talk about the gameplay and and masturbate to the gameplay. I just like talking about nothing, and so that's what you you have. I I have a problem with it. I just talk about nothing, and you know that's why I get these people saying your commentaries are bad. And when I say people, I mean like one guy. I don't really think it's too many. By the way, if you hear me like talking over here, it's because I was like moving around and my microphone's just like right up here in my face so it's really good about picking up you know I'm like oh look I'm on the right side now and then I'm like oh look I'm on the left side now and so it's <laughs> you guys are probably like what the fuck or maybe it's on the left and the right side I'm not sure which way it's gonna pick up on the microphone but I think it's whichever way I'm talking anyway I'm getting off topic talking about my microphone when I really shouldn't be what I want to talk about is more of schooling stuff but there's really not much to to say except for just things that I've seen um, yesterday there was a guy sitting outside, we have a chapel on our campus, like a small one, nobody really ever goes there because, you know, it's not really that big a deal, but there was a guy, uh, I think somebody said he was Mormon, and he was giving away money to people to come up and, you know, do some type of challenge, and he would say, like, he would be like, come up and t test your morality, and I'll give you $20 if you pass the test, and you'd be like, have you ever lied? Have you ever had sex? Have you ever done this? <laughs> And uh, I was thinking it would be so. I didn't really sit down. And look. There was actually like a crowd of people around it, but I didn't want to listen too long. I just thought it would be really funny, like when he's because he was like, "Who will challenge me?" He was like trying to call people out and be like, "Who will be brave enough to face me and you know discuss this?" And he's basically saying like, "I'm right, and anybody who doesn't believe what I believe is wrong, and I dare you to come challenge me because I'll tell you it's, I'm right because the Bible says so or whatever they worship. I don't even know, but um." It, it was kind of stupid and pathetic in a way that, you know, people would agree. I mean, I can understand why somebody would go up there just to show him up, but he's, you know, he knew all his stuff. It's like he studied whatever his religion was, like, obsessively, and was really weird. And he had his five-year-old daughter running around passing out flyers and stuff. And anyway, I just thought that was the complete wrong way to go about things. 
It was basically like he was advertising his religion, and it seemed more like a business than than an actual. Thing. I just hate when people that like, they flaunt their religious beliefs everywhere. I'm not religious. I'm not atheist at the same time. I just don't really care. Um, Diction once said I, I'm agnostic and I take the pussy way out because I just don't care. And I, I agree with him. I don't really care to debate about it. I don't really... I, I just don't care. Simple as that. I've, I've got other things to worry about other than religion. But uh, I don't really want to get into a religious debate so I don't give a shit what your religions are. If you start talking to me about it, if you start trying to argue about it, I'll probably just block you from my channel because... I want to do what I want to do, and other people can do what they want to do. I mean, it's all about what you personally want to do. I think any religion you worship is cool with me. Any religion you don't worship is cool with me. I don't care. It's not a big deal. I'm here to play games and have a good time, and not start shit with other people, because I don't like doing that. But anyway, so this guy was, uh, this guy was challenged. He was like, one dollar to answer this question. It was like simple questions, and then they got progressively harder. He was like, 20 bucks to answer this question, come take a morality test. He was doing all these really sketchy kind of things, but he was giving out all kinds of money. It was, that's why there were so many people gathered around. But uh, I just thought it would be really cool to go up there and when he's doing the morality test, be like, have you ever sinned? I'd be like, yeah, yeah, I've sinned. Have you ever had sex? I'd be like, yeah, yeah, I've had sex. Have you ever uh, lusted? I'd be like, yeah, I've lusted. You ever participated in gluttony? I'm like, yeah, I'm a, I'm a fat guy. And be like, he start starting to ask another question. I interrupt him. They're like, hey, I have a question. What about uh, what about sodomy? Is that cool? Is that really cool? And just <laughs> just to see the reaction on his face, just to do. <laughs> and for those of you who don't know what that is, please Google it so you can laugh about it. Because I just thought it'd be really funny, or 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 just look at him like really closely in the eyes. And be like, what about gay sex? Is that cool? <laughs> do something really uncomfortable for him. Make him feel really awkward, and I thought it would be funny because I love fucking with people who are really religious, especially when I I like to use the fuck word, um, and because they're really they really like throwing their beliefs. Now, once again, religious people are cool when they are you know they go and worship, they want to have faith in something. That's awesome. More power to them. Like my mother, she goes to church. She's really cool. She you know she does her own thing, and she doesn't try and shove it down people's throats or make it into a business she she has faith in a certain thing and and if you want it's, it's kind of like hope you know or hope or faith i think they're around the same area so i mean if you want to have something you can you can use uh, as happiness and believe in then there's nothing wrong with that it's not having false hope or anything like that i, I wouldn't consider it that at all um it's just following what you believe in and you know more power to you but uh but yeah so that's that's my little take on what's been happening on campus. I guess probably what I'm going to try and do with these commentaries is kind of take things that have happened recently or things that I notice. I, I, I'm enjoying the college experience so far, so I think I may take like stories that I have from college every now and then and try and share them with you guys. Maybe not. I don't know. But uh, that, that's just one that I thought of. and It just kind of came to me all of a sudden. I was like, oh yeah, I could talk about this weird guy that was uh, his, spouting his religion all over campus. It was really... He wasn't even a student. He was like fifty something. He just, I guess, he came to the chapel just to, just to get up in all the students' businesses and 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 try and start something. I don't know. But anyway, guys, um, the gameplay is coming up on an end now. I don't really have too much time to talk. This is about a nine minute, almost almost nine minute, about eight and a half minute gameplay. But I want to thank you guys for watching. Big time. Thanks for watching, and uh, I will spoon you guys later.